I am super excited today because I'm going to be sharing with all of you this beautiful paint color by Benjamin Moore called Celestine Blue. It's a Century Line product that came out about a little bit over a year ago. So as your room decor color expert, I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about this paint color and I'm going to give you some valuable tips that you should follow before deciding to paint this color as an accent in your home. So. Let's go. Celestine Blue is Benjamin Moore's high-end paint collection called Century. If you're looking for a bold color and you want to be different from everybody else, then this product line could be for you. Over the past year, I've had the privilege to use many of the Century's product lines, and I can tell you that the colors are the richest and the deepest that you can find anywhere on the market. So let's take a closer look at Celestine Blue. Right here is Celestine Blue by Benjamin Moore and I want you to take a quick look at this picture right over here. I want you to get an up close view of what this paint color looks like. Now having said that this is the only paint color on the market that has a soft matte finish. In other words it feels like when you feel the texture like a soft leather glove. So there's something else I want to show you. When I compare this with Hell Navy by Benjamin Moore, look what just happened. It's a light blue, but it's got a little bit of gray into it. But when I compare it with Carbon Copy by Benjamin Moore, look what just happened. You see a little bit of the violet undertones. This is the only paint product on the market that looks like this. Celestine Blue is absolutely stunning. A quick tip about this paint color is somewhat of a chameleon. It is going to change slightly depending on the type of lighting that you may have in your home. So you need to know what you're doing when comparing this paint color with the other undertones that you may have in your home. I'm going to show you what happens to this beautiful paint color when you put it in a north or south facing room so you can get an idea of how this paint color will react the lighting. So let's take a quick look at this picture right here. This is what Celestine Blue looks like in a south facing room when you get lost in natural sunlight. Notice how rich the blue gray looks in this paint color. But let's take a look at this picture right here. When you put it in a north facing room, notice how it's a little bit darker and the violet undertones are a little bit more pronounced. So the bottom line is, is Celestine Blue excels in both the north and south facing rooms. By the way, if you're new to this channel, feel free to subscribe. I give you valuable information just like this video right here. All right, let's get back to it. There are many different ways that you can use Celestine Blue as an accent color in your home. But today, I want to share with you three contrasting colors that I used for a recent online client who wanted to use Celestine Blue for all three of their kids' bedrooms. So watch this. The first color that I used to pair with Celestine Blue was this beautiful pink color called Strawberry Yogurt by Benjamin Moore. It made this room feel relaxing and soothing. The second color that I used is called Salsa Dancing by Benjamin Moore. It made this room feel exciting and playful. Now, the third color that I used is called Weston Flax by Benjamin Moore. It made this room feel fun and exciting. It was absolutely beautiful. Celestine Blue is a beautiful accent color as long as you pair it correctly with the undertones that you have in your fixed and furnished items in your room, then it will look beautiful. So if you have any questions about Celestine Blue, let me know in the comment section down below. If you're looking for the perfect paint color for your home and you want it professionally done, then you want to check out the link in the description section down below. I tell you how I can help you with my online packages, regardless where you may live in North America. So until then, I'll see you in the next video.